Welcome back guys, today I'll be walking you through a stage 1 remap for BMW X3. I've showed you how to do the EGR and DPF maps before, so this one's just going to be a simple stage 1 remap. So we're going to open up ECM Titanium, click browse and get the original file. That will send the software into the automatic ECU detection. Click abort search so that you can finish the search. Go on the first option for the ECU, double click that and click yes to save the file onto the database. And now you've got all of the maps that you need to work on. We're going to open up the percentage charts that we've got for stage one. I'll highlight the ones we're going to use today, that's for stage one. Back on ECM, I'm going to do the torque limiters first. And I've got the percentage up here already, so I'll just take it down to 35% for this remap. Make sure you press the percent button and press page up. That will increase all of the values and now you can close this and move on to the next one. I'm going to do the same thing on this one. Click enter to go onto the map, have the percent button selected, select all of the data and page up. And now you can close this one as well and move on to the next one. The pressure limiter is 6% so we'll go on to this, press enter and take this down to 1% we're going to select the load from 20 and increase it from there have the percent button selected press page up for this bit and do the same thing five more times so that we can increase it 6% altogether with the gradual change. Once that's done, you can close this and move on to the next one. Okay, now we're going to do injection. For the injection, we're increasing it by 6%. So go onto the map, select the data from 1000 revs and 20 load. Take the percentage to 0.5, have the percent button selected, press page up and then move on with the data, that will increase it by 0.5 each time. Once you've reached 12%, you can close this and move on to the next one. Okay, we're going to do the same thing here. Have the percent button selected and press page up to increase all of the values by 0.5 each time and take it up to 6% in total up to the bottom right corner
once that's done you can close this as well make sure to save and move on to the rail pressure the rail pressure is three percent have the percent button selected select the data from 19 to 1000 and press close up leave two rows and two columns and do the same thing again and keep following through with this pattern so that you can get a gradual increase Once that's done, you can close it and move on to the next one. Phase of injection is going to be 6% as well. So we'll select the data and do the same increase as we've done before. Make sure to have the percent button selected. Press page up and do the same with the rest of the data. And now the next map is the fuel during acceleration. The fuel were increasing by 3% as well. So we'll open the fuel map. And what we're going to do is have the percent button selected. Select the data and increase it by 0.5 each time. And once that's done, you can close that as well. The turbo pressure and the turbo pressure limiters were 6%, so we're going to do the same thing here. Select the data and increase by 0.5 each time, giving you a total of 6% altogether in the end. Once that's done, you can close that and open up the last one and do the same thing here as well. Have the percent button selected and press page up. So that's done you can close that and save it once that's done you can click save and click no it'll ask you to export the modified file click yes 
and I'll go to the main folder and just give it a new name that should be fine it's stage one eco mod and now you can save it and close everything down and if you open up the main folder you'll see the new file is here stage one eco mod thank you for watching please leave a like and subscribe to our channel if you have any suggestions for any other videos that we can make for you then leave a comment on any of our videos and we'll get back to you as soon as possible